All right, here we go. Good question. How do you stop the deep post routes in cover four without having to user the play? So we've all been hit by those PA shot plays, PA shot deep, uh, over the top. Even though you call a cover four defense, uh, people are patient, they take their time, and they end up hitting you way deep downfield for like a tough cross. Yep. Um, how can you stop that? So I don't know if you can show a sample of what it looks like. Uh, I don't have a great plays potentially. But it would be Ted Ginn potentially, Let's right? Let's see. Yeah, that's going to do it. Yeah. So that <laughs> route right there. Yeah. Um, how can you prevent that without having to run backward and use it anytime you see a play action? You're like, oh man, it's probably one of those deep It doesn't plays. even have to be play action, man. It just has to be. I mean, that's wide open. Um, the first thing I would recommend is to give your defense a base align. Um, and the reason for it is you want your defenders to just stay in one central location and mm -hmm. see if it changes their drop steps. So let's run this here real quick. Let's see if that make anyone... Nope. So, so what's happening is he at least... Yeah, yeah he made it better. better. They are better. And that's because they... When you don't base a line, look at the alignment. Like, look how close Malcolm Butler, whoever that far left corner is. Yeah. He's in, so he pays more attention to what I want him to do. I want him to pay attention to that, to that curl. little curl right there. So because he's closer to him, he, he just kind of – see how he sat on him? Like, right. he sat on him. And it's because of how close he is. Now, we'll see if it makes a, much of a difference here. But with a, one simple tip, just the baseline can help improve that uh, because he's not going to pay as much attention to it. He did there. Yeah, he did. But you can see that they're getting back a little contextual awareness. That's a concept. straight user pick. That's a good play, yeah. Um, but the, the next thing I would say is if you play man-to-man, -man, oh, he wants to do it in cover four. Yeah, I would say you do this, and this has worked for me. Yeah. Number one, you uh, shade your coverage over the top. Yeah. Which is why up on the right stick, and then hold down the left trigger and flick up. That's going to pass commit. So at the snap, they should get deep. So see how he's backing up at the snap? He bit even harder, though, there. That's weird. Uh, and that was just a bad throw, but... What, what I do find is... I think I found myself a... A, a zone beat or... So when we baseline, this guy got deep. But what I'm trying to do is make sure this guy knows, hey, it's a pass, and I want you to back up at the snap and not really pay attention. So go now. Like, we don't want him... Okay, he'll... See, he's trying to, like, jump X. That's that's what you do not want. And the reason that that play works um, is they want, because... They go to the curl. They, they go to curl. So you got to get him away from the curl. When I play quarters, three deep... Um, my safeties are fast enough to recover, and that's basically how I stay with it. But otherwise, yeah, I guess you maybe have to user it. Um, well, no, you. I mean, just the, ba no, no, just no, the baseline work, but no, the pass no. commit actually made it worse. Yeah, no, you go ahead and do um, spotlight, spotlight. Okay, post. okay, the, yeah. spot, the, the spotlight works. So we press. It's a more adjustments, y, but a R B A. Okay, no. so we just... No, it's RB. You wanted to go after RB. I did. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So we spotlit RB, and the game's going to pay attention to him. Let me uh. give you a little more time. So to spotlight a receiver and say, hey, pay attention to this guy, you press, let's baseline, we'll go Y, A, RB for Ted Ginn, and then A to spotlight him, and go. Don't rush those guys, please. Oh, well, yeah, I'll give you time. See how he's going with him? He didn't though. It's almost, it's almost, it's almost worse. This might be a special play. This play might be really good. <laughs> Rams. And normally, this no the spotlight normally works. Let's see, let's see it again. So here we go. Y, A, Ted Yin, spotlight. And let's I'm go. gonna base a line. Go. Uh, hang on. Okay, go. Might just be in the most tender. Alignment of all time. It's pretty good. We're gonna have to dissect this. Do this. Just flip the play. Just flip it for me. Just entertain me. Spotlight. Uh, just you know, just leave it. Leave it organic, real raw, organic like. Flipped. No, he ran into it. Actually, he was gonna get. He was gonna get torched there. Uh, do this for me. Uh, hit uh, on baseline. Hit re baseline. Hit. Um, Y and the RB, and give me a press. Yeah. All right. There you go. Boom. That was that was much better. Do that again. Just just this time hit uh, Y RB, which is going to man a line, 
and then press. The press might be the key. And here. I'm gonna over the top. Sure. Play over the top coverage. Sure. Whatever, whatever floats your boat. Okay, maybe not. So maybe we're gonna, cover we're four is to, not the play to stop it. We're gonna have to. Okay, do this for me next. Do this for me. I'm now. telling you, if you get yeah. if you we, get we Golden gotta, Ticket, Landon Collins, we get, yeah, we got a lot. It stops it because uh, the, they're fast enough to get backwards. But deep that's zone, not deep zone, McCordy. Deep zone, McCordy. Re deep. Yep, and re deep uh, the far left guy. Just try. It. Just entertain me. No, nope. oh, they both jump. It's worse. This might be the best. Go to cover three real quick. Entertain. This is a live lab, folks. Entertain me, Farls. All right. You need time in the pocket. I'll tell you that much, right? Dear diary, that's the best deep ball I've ever seen. Wow. All right, here we go. Did we just invent this? So we got cover four. I'm gonna shade my coverage over the top and base align. Go. Good luck. Good luck, bro. Good good luck, bro, Tata Chip. <laughs> hey, hey, real quick. I'll show you how to stop it real quick. Um, just audible to cover two, man. Okay. You good? I'm good. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's it? There you go. So just don't I, I, call cover four. Listen, that's not the good answer. That's not the answer I want to give you. I don't have enough time to find the answer right now in National Live Internet. I mean, you could do this, but... Do just, what? Like, man him mm, up, but... I don't think that's going to work. I think it'll work. I think it'll be worse. He's going to just get beat when he makes the cut. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Guess what I'm using next time I play you. Yeah, the pressing could definitely work. Um, I think this... Uh, guys, I think this might be the perfect formula, like, in terms of... Like where the receivers are on the field, I, I, it's causing the problem. Go, do it again. All right. I spot lit. Yeah, did nothing. Yikes. I I think it's the perfect storm. Do it one more time. I think it's the perfect storm. Let me see. Why? I mean, all right. It's almost worse. I got him. This is gonna. You dropped them yeah. too far back. It's fine. He went with him where he's supposed to. Because that's I'll just keep... thirty cut went with him because the spotlight. That's why he went with. <sighs> that's why that guy's going there. Let, let yeah. me let me let's dissect this. Let's no now 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 I'm committed. Now I'm now I'm freaking committed. All right, let's go. Th there's got to be. It could be the halfback route. Like, I don't think so. It's the safety pays attention to the curl, but he shouldn't. And there's no getting me, him to not let do me, it. Let me let me just block my halfback real quick. Oh, they're also saying that A is now getting wide open. Yeah, well, A is going to do when you do the... When you do the spotlight. Oh. Yeah. Well, that when you do the spotlight, yeah. That's what Sirius right. Mo was trying to do. Yeah. Do this. Uh, I do spotlight. I, I over the top coverage, and I pass commit. You're so toasted. I could have got... Okay, here, I, got a, I, got, I think I got an answer. Here, you take the auto stick... You take the O stick. I don't want to touch that. What do you want me to do? You're sick. I'm not sick. You're sick. I'm not sick. I appreciate you playing hurt. Allergies. What? All right. So slot out? No. What? That's a Rams crosses. All right. No. Don't. Don't pick that play. Don't. No. Okay. Go to three four odd. Cover four. Cover four drop. No. Cover four. Cover four. All right. This is what I'm gonna do. I want you to baseline. Okay. I want you to spread your linebackers. I want you to shift your linebacker. It will D line right. And I want you to crash your D line. Let me see the, the play. All right. Crash your D line to the right. Yeah. And blitz all your linebackers. Contain. Drop that guy into his own. Which guy? You're on, the guy you're on. User the linebacker behind him. Drop your coverage deep. Drop your coverage deep. What does that mean? Back them up. Now, now, just, just, yeah. here's, here's what I think is going to happen. Because you can drop your, you, without moving the rest of your secondary, you can drop your linemen, their corners deep here. That's what I like about this formation. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. We're getting to there. Mm-hmm. That's how you would stop it? Um, just do this time. This time, just baseline. Back your coverage up deep. Just don't rush anybody. I just want to see if... Yeah. And do whatever you did on the last play. I think I spread. We want, we're trying to find a way to shade it. Because yeah. you can shade the other ones. Oh, God. A good play. Yeah. That, this is unbelievable, guys. This is this is a big time play. That one right there with the chuck on Gin helps not at all. <laughs> oh my god. I'm telling you, it's the alignment of the formation that's causing this. It's the alignment, is what it is. And what we're saying is yes, we understand we could user it. Yes, I understand yes. I could stand in front of Ted Ginn and press RB, but the specific question we're trying to answer is go. You could do all those things, yeah, but we're saying how do you do it without having to how do you get how do you get those deep safeties to react? We understand you can do a lot of things. That's why we said like, oh you go to man to man. Just play cover two man. Like the other thing I would do is I would just user it. Like yeah. I would just run back and user it. I'd recognize As soon as I see what it is, go like go. Like right now I know what it is. Right. As soon as you see that guy going deep the other the other alternative is you know it need they need time in the pocket. Right. Send the send the dog, send the boys. You don't think I'm gonna throw a couple of these TDs on people though? You're gonna be out of your your mind. Good play. Just man up McCordy on the running back real quick. Where I don't him? Know, someone's saying man him up. I don't know if they if it's something they actually know. I'll I'll see. Let's I don't see. think it's gonna work, but we'll try it. It's gonna. No. Yeah. It seemed like a bad idea. <laughs> it didn't seem like a good idea. So. Can I? Can you write that play down for me? No. I would like that. I'm gonna. You're gonna use it in the game of the week. Yeah. I would like that play very yeah. much. This play? Yes. Why is it good? Is it the best deep ball you've ever seen? That's a really good deep ball. That's a really good user pick strafe. No. Oh, stop! Stop chirping how good you are at user pick strafe. You never do it in game. So it doesn't matter. Give me one more. That's a good user pick strafe. This is a Madden 12 pick for you new cats. You want to get to the front of the circle? Get aggressive. All Remember right, strafe swats? Pretty legit. Oh. All right, here we go. Next mailbag question. We hit that one up. Sort of. <laughs> Big Slow 17 wants to know, Gibbs, which new cleats in Madden 17 are your favorite? There was a gameplay blog today. Tweeted it out. Yeah. Some fire. <laughs> foot fire. Uh, Feet which, heat. Which Feet did heat, you like? kid. Got to be the Jays. Got to be the Earl Thomas Jays and the Des Bryant Jays. I, I mean, like without a doubt. The Nikes. The Cam Newtons are fresh. probably my favorites They're fresh. in there. Took a poll on Twitter, at Madden Bible. Nike defeated Under Armour and Adidas. Did they? Pretty pretty, pretty hefty. Oh. 